Hey everyone, this is Learning Target 7. I can determine scale on a number line or an XY axis. So on these problems, all you're doing is filling in the missing numbers. So I know that I have 0 and 9 here, but I'm not sure what numbers go here. You could do guess and check if you wanted. So what if I thought it went by 2? So 0, 2, 4, 6. Well, that doesn't work. Um, so I could try 3, 0, 3, 6, 9. All right, that works. So this is 3, 6, 9. I add three more, that's 12. I add three more, that's 15. Okay. Or if you want to do it a different way, you could figure out, well, this distance is nine, and I'm cutting it up. There's one, two, three sections I'm cutting it up into. So if I take nine divided by three sections, that's going to be three per section. So that's how I know it's going to be a three. All right, down here, even though it's an xy axis, it's pretty much the same thing. It's just two number lines. Here's one number line, and then here's one that's horizontal. So why don't we start with the uh, vertical one? So same idea is up here. So I start at zero. I know this is always zero. So um, I could do guess and check again. So maybe I'll try 10, 0, 10, 20, 30. That didn't work. Um, maybe 4. 4, 8, 12, that was too small, uh, maybe 5, 5, 10, 15. Okay, so that worked. And then remember with the graph, it just goes down into the negatives. So I'm still going by 5, so I have 0, negative 5, negative 10. All right, for the x-axis here, or the other number line, same idea. So I'm at 0 and negative 4. Um, so I realize it goes by 2s because negative 2 negative 4, negative 6. So even if it's negative, it's still the same idea, and I'll continue the trend this way. So I have negative 2, 0, 2, 4, and 6.